Welcome back to that Podcast here on YouTube. I thought I covered this was another one I thought I covered. It. I might have talked about it for a second when I picked it up. Because I want to say this was a pawn shop pickup. It might have been a thrift store, but probably pawn shop. This is in like Flint. This is the second of the Flint series of films, which was uh, James Cogburn. Basically, is a parody of Bomb. This was more, this wasn't like your Austin Powers parody. And Austin Powers is mentioned right there on the cover, of course. That's the one this came out. This is when this DVD came out. Because this film came out in 67. So this film's older than I am. Uh, and it wasn't like your scary movie, Naked Gun, you know, that style parody. It felt more like a British style parody to me. And the thing was, when I saw this, I'd seen like two Bond films. And it was Saturday or Sunday. My dad or mother, I might have been both of them. Being excited because they read the TV guide like, it was Sunday. Because I remember we had to set the VCR because we are going to miss the first one because of church in the morning. They were showing our man Flint, and then in like Flint, all on the local channels. And we're coming home and watching. I love, love the hell out of them. And so what I found is I had to grab Great cover. Kind of got that pop art look to it. Like the yellow case. And then we go on the back here. 007 is a great number. And Austin, power, Austin has his powers, but nobody is really in like Flint. He's back in the ultimate spy suit. This time going head to head with a group of wealthy and powerful female tycoons who have discovered a way to brainwash women through beauty salon hair dryers. And if that's not enough, they then replace the president with the surgically reproduced clone as part of their super evil plan to take over the world. In this outrageous adventure where the bad guys are girls, Flint must infiltrate the women's secret lair, a lush and lavishly tropical spa called Fabulous Face before gals wreck more havoc. 1967, 114 minutes color. No real extras. I mean, you got, uh, you got, it's the right aspect ratio, and that's about it. But as far as the plot goes, I mean, that's the good, and I just love the hell out of This is one of those, I don't hear anybody talking about, I like the design. I like the design. I mean, look at the little card here. It's probably close to what the poster. That's probably the poster right there. And then scene selection. Modesty Blaze. Phantom and Our Man Flint. Okay, they said they like four sexy spy spoofs. And there's a good handful of these bond spoofs. There's a lot of Italian made ones and all this shit. This is probably the only one from that era I watched and really enjoyed. It was just, you know, got to see them when I was you know, five, six, seven. Had to be at least five because I remember what channel they aired on, and we didn't. You know that channel was not on there. We didn't know it was on there until I was five because I was in kindergarten. That's the only reason I knew how old I was. I remember being excited at school that day, coming home because I was like, "Oh, I get to watch cartoons and I have different cartoons." What I see on there because the other channel had like Tom and Jerry. Look at that, it's great. And this is one where you know what. I gotta get the. I actually want all four of these now. Since so I know it's a seller, they're all designed like this. That'd be pretty cool. Well, hope you enjoyed that. And if you did, give me a thumbs up. Leave a comment, subscribe, all the other bullshit. Talk to everybody later. Bye bye.